Hey guys, so it just came to me that I haven't done a best of Instagram edits 2019 video yet. Now going through my Instagram from last year, it was pretty obvious to me the main theme of last year was my back. Some of you probably know I kind of hurt my back somewhere around February last year and it took like almost half a year for me to be like back to normal. So all of my edits somehow revolve around my pain issue. So the first post, I actually didn't want to uh, display here, show you guys, because it's actually the day or the, the main cause, the, the main thing that after that my my back problems started. It was the gnarly backside, no, the gnarly big spin heel off the sushi dish thingy at Skate Island. So it was really cold that day, it was like really freezing, it was like an ice storm just like a couple minutes before I actually started filming. And there was a puddle of water. I, I don't know why this puddle wasn't frozen, but I fell in it, of course, and my bag and everything. And it was really cold. And then it made snap in my back, said no more. And yeah, but here's the edit. Yeah, pretty lame. But the next one is really cool. I really love to make this edit. It is my uh, best of bails, falls, smashes, whatever you want to call it, video of I think like ever till this point. And the funny thing is that the main feedback I got from this video was actually Hey dude, now I know why you have back problems. And I can guarantee to you that is not true. It's actually the opposite because right when I started, when my back problems started to occur, it was the same time when I started at a new work where I almost only sat, I didn't move at all and that's what really messed up my back. So yeah, believe me or not, but my back problems didn't really have to do with skateboarding. It was mainly because I sit too much. And one more thing about the edit, so I really hate watching other people bail smash hit eat shit but uh, i love watching myself eat. i don't know why it's so funny i think <laughs> i don't know i just have to laugh about that shit because maybe it makes me like more relaxed when skating and if i don't know but here it is Okay, the next edit, of course, is also a montage I made of clips I already had because my back was really hurting and I couldn't skate at all. And this montage edit I did, I, I wanted to make so bad. It's my Sketchmaster 9000 edit. Okay, now, you probably don't know what Sketchmaster 9000 is, so I have some sort of a gift or, uh, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know if you want to call it a gift, 
I have the the ability to land tricks that seem to be impossible and it looks like really sketchy shitty and that's my thing and it occurred to me really early in my skating career that that is a thing so I had to negate it because people always tell me how did you land that and <laughs> I think it's really funny I put a nice music on it that kind of fits so enjoy <laughs> Yeah, and that got me the nickname Sketchmaster9000. Well, I think I kind of gave that to myself. Uh, you know, the, the Dragon Ball set thing. It's over 9000! It's over 9000! And I just combined that with my sketchiness, so yeah. So the next edit I love a lot. It's the East Coast trip I did in May, I guess. It was May, yeah. So I went to New York, Boston, Toronto, Chicago, and to Minneapolis. And I made an edit of that. There is not that much of skating in it because I had like back problems. But I really love this video for the main reason. If every time you watch this video, well it has dope music on it. it I really love the, the vibe of it. But when I watch that, it kind of makes gives me a really good feeling here. And it's like that's what I dream my life to be like like traveling skating seeing these fantastic places and this video portrays that pretty good so that's why I like the edit tell me what you think about it So there's not much to say about the next one. You have nice weather, you have a skate park, it's summer, and you have a skateboard, and just good times, cool tricks. And I'm really stoked about the line I did, the kick flip up the curb, then the double flip, and then the tray flip. That happened like second try or something. I'm really stoked about that. I think it looks pretty cool. And yeah, so enjoy. So 
the next one, we went on a trip with the skate club to Bayreuth and Marktredwitz. Um, yeah, those are German places, Marktredwitz, funny name. But yeah, I really wanted to put this edit in there because that was the first day ever after my back problem started where I could skate the entire day and didn't feel like shit. Usually it was like skate 30 minutes and then it was over. My back couldn't do anymore. But um, Chris came to Germany. She did some massages and stuff and all of a sudden everything loosened up and I was able to skate again the whole day. And we went on a really cool trip with cool people, cool skate parks. Weather was insane. So yeah, it's also the first or one of the rare Instagram edits where I put like heavy metal or rock music on it. And probably most of you don't know, I've played in a metal band, drums, for I think 10, 10 years or something. So I actually really like metal music, but I think they don't really fit like on a skateboard edit. I don't know why. If you try to edit to a rock heavy metal song, it, it's only one tempo. It's like bam, 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 trick, trick, trick. And there's no dynamic to that except really fast. And I love that. I love watching serial videos, but... Um, if I want to make edits, I am trying to pace it a little bit, and that's really hard with rock music. So, but in this edit, I felt like, yes, I'm happy. I can skate again. Here are a lot of cool tricks at a cool skate park. I'm gonna bam, bam, bam. So, here, here it is. Okay, the next edit is also at Skate Island, Bamberg, and it's with probably my most favorite people on the planet. It's Jake is in it, Caress is in it, and this skateboarding. I think the song I picked gave it a whole another dynamic and makes it like really disturbing or also like gangster shit or what. I really love how it turned out, and there's some cool tricks in it. I'm stoked about my crooked grind down this ledge. You, this this hubble ledge is massive. I never done it before. And yeah, I'm really stoked about that. And also the double flip down to six there. That was stoked. I, I, I got a couple nice slams on that one. And really stoked that I landed it. So, here you go. So the next one is probably one of my all-time favorite edits. It is when we went to Berlin with the skate club, caress me, the skate club, and it was it was insane. I have really good memories of this weekend. It happened so much, so much skating, so much places, and so much short of time. And I tried to put everything into one minute. Uh, picked some cool songs and there's so much energy it's so much dancing and skating I really love it guess what guys we're going to Berlin with the skate club <laughs> <laughs>
So number nine and the last one of my best of Instagram edits 2019 is season final of Cavelogs. It's the one where I went to Santa Cruz for a week together with Caress and Daniel and we did so much. We skated, shredded, all of it. It was a 20 minute YouTube video and I tried to put all of the, the clips and everything into a one minute video. It, it kind of like really um, got a really bad response on Instagram, but nonetheless, I really like it. I think it's it's amazing to um, the, the K vlogs was a really big, big thing last year to me. It was such a cool time. The three months Chris was in Germany, and that's this was kind of like the the end of it. After like watching all the clips and coming back to Germany, and and I had this I it's this like a realization that this is like this is a dream. I, I'm living my dream right now and it is insane and I'm so happy. And I also tried to write something meaningful under the post. Open your eyes or something or else you're gonna like see your dreams pass by or don't see your dreams pass by because you have your eyes closed. But yeah, wake up because you're already living your dream life. That is what I ch was trying to portray in this Instagram edit and yeah, I love it. So here you go. Okay guys, this is all. This is a very long video. I'm sorry for that, but I think it had to be done because I really love making these edits and I think a lot of you guys who are not on Instagram, uh, they you deserve to see them because I put a lot of work into those. And yeah, here you go. Hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Bye.